Will the Sesame Yeezy sell out? Is it even worth buying? What is that resale market looking like? That is what we're going to be talking about in this video. What's going on, guys? This is your guy, James Raw. Thank you so much for checking out this video, and I got a couple questions for you guys, man. Will the Yeezy 350 V2 Sesame sell out? Before we talk about that, let's talk about the last three Yeezy releases. Let's talk about the Yeezy creams that actually got restocked on September 21st. Those things didn't even sell out, man. They didn't even sell out. I got to the point where Adidas actually took them off the website. They didn't even sell. They did a double brick. The resale value on those sneakers was very, very low. Very, very low. A lot of people lost a lot of money with those sneakers. Second pair we're going to be talking about is the Yeezy 700 Moves. Those things didn't even sell out until like a couple of days later. Let's keep it real. Let's keep it 100. People not paying $300 for no purple sneakers, man. They not. I'm sorry. They just not. Then the third pair, the Concourse of the Yeezy model. Yeah, I said it. The Zebras. Oh. Actually dropped last Friday, November the 16th. They sold out pretty fast. They sold out in a couple hours. Even though they were in mass production, they still did pretty well. Raffles was still given for the sneaker. And uh, those things were selling like hotcakes. Which begs the question, how are the Sesames going to do this upcoming Black Friday? That's when it's coming out, on Black Friday. Will you guys be camping out for it? Will you guys be doing a raffle? Let me know in the comments. Give you guys my prediction. My prediction, they will sell out. They will sell out. Sorry. They're just going to sell out. Do you know why they're going to sell out? Because this is a first time colorway. Yeah, this is not a restock. This is not a double stock. I know the moles were a first time colorway as well too, but it's just something about V2s that people just love. People are really digging the light tan with the gum outsole. It's not really my cup of tea. I ain't even going to lie to you guys. I'm, I think I'm going to pass on this pair, but they still look nice. They still look nice. Just a little too plain for me. My second question to you guys is, are they worth buying? Absolutely yes. They are worth buying because they are very unique. I think this will be a good sneaker to cop. Now with that resale market looking like according to StockX, these sneakers are going over just a little bit past 230. You're not really going to make that much money off this sneaker. It looks pretty low because it's going to be in mass production. Adidas is going out with a bang in 2018. Yes, they are. They are fulfilling promises. If you're tired of the same model, the same colorways, that keep re-releasing i highly highly suggest you cop these sesames man because they're just different they are an amazing fall slash winter sneaker but enough what i think about the sneaker i really want to know what you guys think about the sneaker do you think the sneaker is going to sell out is this a must cop let me know in the comments make sure you guys hit that like button make sure you guys hit that subscribe button thank you guys so much for checking out this video i see y'all when i see y'all